Hey guys, welcome to my channel, No Future in Fronting, where thou shalt not front. Um, I'm so excited because it's officially been one year since I've given up meat. Oh my God, like, I don't know. I'm so excited. Like, y'all have no idea. Especially with all these reports out about how processed meat is causing cancer. And if you know me, you know I loved an all beef hot dog on a grill. Ooh, my favorite. But now I'll F with that because I changed my life. So, getting that news and getting those reports, reading them. Although I already knew that, it's crazy because... Um, it makes me feel that I'm doing the right thing. I have no regrets, not a single regret. I do not miss steak. I do not miss pork. I do not miss bacon. Um, I do not miss any of these things. Yes, I enjoyed them when I ate them, but now that I know better, I do better. There are so many other um, meat alternatives. There are so many other foods, just plant-based foods that we can eat and that I've introduced myself to since I've given up meat. And... Um, I just as my mind changed, I feel that I think a lot more clear than I was when I was eating meat. Um, I've stopped taking my ADD medicine and I'm so happy for that because I've been taking Adderall and Vyvanse for many years and I felt that I could not um, focus without it and I've been doing great, you know. Yes, I'm still kind of scattered and because I get excited and um, that's just me, but as far as mental clarity got it but um yeah also um i just want to talk about five things that have changed and so one is it seems i have less friends now <laughs> i don't know if i'm like the weird vegan chick now or what but it's fine because um my life has changed so dramatically in the last just even year that it was important for me to kind of um change my surroundings and watch my energy and I'm so protective of my energy and my space and my peace and um, I'm actually grateful that I have lost some of the friends that I had when I was eating meat not that I lost friends because I was eating meat or didn't um, eat meat but you know I think that when you are starting to progress in your life it makes the others who are stagnant around you uncomfortable and when you are making a change in your life that you know is important and you know is right for you be mindful of that and stay true to yourself. Do not allow others' uncomfortability with your growth to stunt it. Um, yeah, I just have to get that out there. So, other than that, um, besides me just introducing myself to so many more foods, I have energy. Um, like I read, if you've written, blah, 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 if you read my blog, you know I was struggling with this lump this foreign lump in my throat for many years and it is completely healed and disappear. Hallelujah. Holla back. Hallelujah. Holla back. Yeah, that's a fact. So I'm super excited about that. And, um, also what else has changed? My whole life has changed since I stopped eating swan. Anyway, so um, I don't know. This may this video you may see a little bit more of my personality because I plan on editing this, and so I'm not trying to um just remember the next thing I'm gonna say. I'm kind of able to be more of my silly self. So anyway, I'll probably edit that part out though because I know your business. Um, also, that'd be cute like this. So, um, what else, what else, what else, what else, what else, what else has changed? What else has changed? What's changed? What else has changed? What's changed? What else has changed? What, 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 what else? Um, oh my goodness. So the level of compassion that I have has completely changed. Um, I would like to say this. I became, I gave up meat for health reasons, but the more I informed myself about the meat industry, um, about the way it's harming our environment, I've watched many documentaries, and so um, I believe that everyone becomes vegetarian for different reasons, okay? Um, one may be that, for their health reasons, like I said, my reason was for health, and 